Hey everybody, it is Sunday after VidCon. Um, okay. You okay in the sun over there, girlfriend? Griffin seems to get it. She's like, I don't like the sun. <sighs> I'm gonna go over there in a bit, but I uh, wanted to talk to you guys about this really quickly. When I looked at this house to move into it, it was December, and uh, these were not in season, and I'm not a good plant person. Um, but as the summer went on, we realized that they were, in fact, grapes, which are not allowed in my house. Raisins and grapes are very toxic to dogs. Probably one of my biggest fears to just have a raisin or a grape on the floor and one of these two eats it, and now I am living in my nightmare. They were just falling everywhere. Right now, if you can see, Mike has some burlap underneath to catch any of those grapes. I mean, we'll still supervise these two because we don't need them. I'm pretty sure Griffin can reach. Today, we're going to make them just slightly more robust, and I'm gonna sew like more burlap onto, I guess, like the edges of those and bring it, bring it up so that anything that falls off the side also rolls down into those nets. Is, is your foot stuck in this balloon? All right, go ahead, go upstairs. <laughs> Are you gonna be okay? You too, go ahead, go upstairs. Are you gonna follow me? Okay. Let's go next to you. Yeah. Hello? <laughs> How are you gonna get out of that? You did it. Oh my gosh, what are you doing? Good morning. Oh, you're stuck? What in the world? <laughs> oh no. Uh, yes. Oh, okay. You play with those stairs. <laughs> Good morning. And fall over. And fall over. Good job. <laughs> Why do you do that every time? All right, guys. Griffin is leashed up, and she is attached to me. She thinks we're going somewhere, but we're not going anywhere. We're just tired of her peeing and pooping in the house. She knows where to pee. She knows how to tell us how to pee, like she has to pee. But every time I turn around, or every time she gets jealous of Phoenix, she pees in the house. On the carpet. I've had it. So you can earn your freedom back in a bit. But I'm sorry. This is what's happening for now. I cannot turn around and take my eyes off of you. Good job, buddy. Phoenix, don't get jealous. She's not going anywhere. She's just having no freedom in the house. Do you do you think we're going somewhere? We're not going anywhere. This is the same leash that Falcon had to drag around when she first joined our family. And she kept peeing in the house and attacking Phoenix. All right, we got a pool for Tiny and us. <laughs> Phoenix is like... This pool looks so dumb now compared to that giant pool. This is your pool, okay? It's, it was always your pool, and now it's your pool again. Don't pull the plugs. Tiny has outgrown this tiny pool, and now it's time for big pool. It's kind of cold right now, so we're probably not going to fill this up tonight. It's like, what, 8 o'clock right now? <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> I'm like a turtle. You're like a 
turtle. Yes. Phoenix is just standing here waiting for us to fill it with water. She's like, um, is anyone going to help me here? Yeah, so that's your only, that's your pool now. And I, we believe Griffin does not like water. Jump! Okay, this is, I guess, drinking water and, oh, you're making a whirlpool? Are you going to join us or is it too scary? Oh, Griffin's going to drink it too. They're both drinking it, except Phoenix has one foot in it. <laughs> Do you want to get in your pool? Good girl. Oh, Phoenix is in. Good job. Good job. Good job. Oh, is Griffin going to join? I won't. Griffin, are you going to join? Are you going to join? He's so good to walk. It's Kikaroo. Kikaroo. Oh, Griffin is just treating this like a giant water bowl. You know, everyone's feet is in that giant water bowl. That water is dirty. Right? Uh, not that dirty, but you did just put your shoes in it. Phoenix is like, I'm not impressed. I want the big pool. <laughs> All right. We're in it. We're in it. Half in the sun, half in the shade. Your own personal pool? You can go in your pool. Go ahead. Go ahead in your pool. Wow. Yay. Oh. You're so happy. Look at all of Griffin's hair floating around. Bye-bye, Griffin's hair. All right, we're trusting you not to pop this thing with your toenails. and asking to come in there. Are you done now? You look like Rocky. Except as a shark. There you go. Alright, we're gonna have to take off I... here. Oh my gosh. Almost got chomped. Come on in. By a shark. By a shark. Speed shopping for snacks so we can make it to our drive-in movie. Speed shopping. Ooh, I like any iced tea that has that is unsweetened. <laughs> you don't have to scream. You can whisper, I stopped here. I stopped here. <laughs> Where, what are we doing? What are you doing? Oh my god. Speed, we're speed shopping. You're going or what's there? So we're going to our first drive in movie. I don't think they have these in New Jersey. Do they have these in New Jersey? Not that, not that we knew of. And I think the closest one to us is in Pennsylvania, so we'd have to drive there. But look, there's a screen. Wait, I can't really see it. Oh, there's a screen right there. There's like, this one has four screens. Four screens? Yeah, and we've got our snacks right here by my feet. And there's sushi at the bottom, so I'm very excited about the sushi. It's kind of late, so uh, this one already had his bath and whatnot, so we're kind of just hoping he falls asleep. You guys, look at this. And there's a sign over there that's like, <coughs> Toy Story Spider-Man. Oh my God, so cool, so cool, so cool. Good morning. Good morning, buddy. We're on our way to brunch. We just gave the dogs all their medicine and stuff. And then after that, we're going to Michaels, we're going to a craft store so we can get some supplies to tie-dye some shirts. Tiny's favorite shirt right now is his tie-dye shirt, which he took out of the hamper so that he could wear today, which I don't know, we just let him do it. He's gonna get a cooler tie-dye shirt in a bit. <laughs> French toast. We're going into the store. We're going to get our tie-dye stuff. Okay, where's the tie-dye stuff? Okay, I found the stuff. I think I might either get this one. Whoa! Put it in the cart. Go ahead, put it in the cart. Good job. All right, let's go. 
We went to Walmart to get shirts that fit this one, and we actually found a cheaper tie-dye kit. So I guess that's what we're doing. Yeah? All right, so we went to Walmart to get tiny shirts that fit him because they don't have like toddler 40 shirts at Michael's and we saw a tie-dye kit that was like so much cheaper at Walmart. So we're gonna return the other one, which makes me very uncomfortable. So I think I'd make Mike do it. I'm making Tiny and myself a milkshake. I put frozen strawberries, frozen bananas, milk, and vanilla ice cream in there. This one. <laughs> Do you like it? Mm -hmm. I like it. Can I have some of mine? Yeah. Mm. That's really good. Uh, where are you going? <laughs> so we made a little table, a tie-dye table. Mike made it in like five minutes. We got chicken wire to put on top of it to lay the shirts on. Hey! Hey! Go get her. Oh, she's stuck. Go. Oh, pick it up before she pulls the sprinkler out. Pick oh my up. God. That's not a place to tie her down. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> when you're walking the dog, it's your job to walk the dog, okay? You can't just leave her. Yeah, that's a sprinkler. You'll that dog is so much ground. bigger than you. Griffin. <laughs> what you doing? Are you like in a raft ride or something? Do you want some waves? <laughs> so uh, our super special custom tie-dye table is almost done. <laughs> I guess we could use this for other projects like that we need to like spray paint or whatever. We could paint some Easter eggs on this. That's so far away. Hey right, guys. I've already rinsed out all the other tie-dyes. It's time to rinse this one out. Are you gonna help me? You're my helper? Oh my gosh, I have another helper. So many helpers!